uh, this is Brother Muhammad Jamil, he asked, is there any famous Indian personality who embraced Islam recently? Please inform us. The brother would like to know if there is any famous personality in India that has embraced Islam. One thing we should keep in mind that Islam considers everybody to be equal. If Allah honors somebody with fame, that is a different thing. So we should not look upon the famous personalities to embrace Islam. The leaders of the tribes, okay, it carries weight sometimes. That you know, if so and so person is embraced Islam, there must be something good in Islam. It carries weight sometimes, but not always. Because it is the Quran actually. That is the main reason, the teaching of the Quran that spreads Islam. It is the teaching of the Quran. There's a lady, a very famous poet, Kamla Das. She's from Kerala, as far as I know my information, that she had embraced Islam a couple of years back. And she was a very popular writer and a poet. It gave a boost to the people of the Kerala, those people who are involved in the Islamic centers. They say that we have got a good boost to our momentum. No, fine, it's Alhamdulillah. But per se, Islam does not require famous people's label to propagate itself. Islam will be propagated on its merit, on the merit of the Quran, on the teachings of the Quran. Look, if I have to tell a non-Muslim, inviting him to Islam, I would not tell him, you know, so and so person has become a Muslim, so you also become a Muslim. What I would say, give a try to this book, friend. Read it, you read so many things, read it this also. See, find out if you find something interesting, you come and discuss with me. If something doesn't enter your throat, you come and ask me, I'll take you to the person who knows more than me, if I don't satisfy you. So Islam should be spread, and Islam is spreaded on its own merit, on the merit of the propagation of the Quran. This is the miracle of Quran, and it does not depend upon popular people. I hope that answers it. Uh -huh.